Welcome back to This Week in Penn State Football. We're tackling the news of the day for Penn State's program. I'm Dustin Hockensmith. The 2018 NFL Draft is in the books. Six Nittany Lions were drafted. Fourteen total found NFL homes, either as draftees or, or as unsigned, undrafted free agents. The focus immediately, as it does in today's media world, shifted to the 2019 draft already. Jawan Johnson, according to Eric Galco from the Sporting News, one of the top 10 prospects for the 2019 draft. He's a redshirt junior wide receiver this season. He's got a lot of work to do in order to reach that point, but physically he makes the grade. I want to focus on Trace McSorley, who will be going into Penn State's third season as, as a quarterback there. And I think it was really good for him that Baker Mayfield from Oklahoma got picked number one overall from the Cleveland Browns. A lot of people will draw similarities between Mayfield and McSorley, mainly because both of them are viewed as undersized for that position. Mayfield listed at 6'1", 215. Uh, Trace McSorley listed, listed at six foot and about 200 pounds. They aren't quite the same player, but I think they both score really high marks for their competitiveness and the way that they can elevate uh, players around them. Mayfield went number one to the Cleveland Browns. It shows that the NFL is starting to shed that stigma about undersized quarterbacks. They're looking for things beyond the, the traditional measurables. I think Mayfield has a little bit more arm talent. He's a little bit thicker, a little bit more gifted overall than McSorley, but if McSorley goes into his third season and pushes for the Heisman Trophy. He leads Penn State to another really big time campaign, puts up big numbers, which I think he will. He should be knocking on the door, maybe not number one overall, but an early round pick, maybe the first or second round. We'll see how the 2018 season goes. But Mayfield is a really good case study for Trace McSorley. I'm Dustin Hockensmith with This Week in Penn State Football.